And you must understand BRICS is an organization, a bloc that has openly called for de-dollarization. So having Saudi Arabia, the backbone of the petrodollar, join BRICS. Oh, I mean, you couldn't make up a bigger slap in the face. It was already bad when, you know, last year, Joe Biden went begging to Saudi Arabia, asking them for some extra oil so he can, you know, push prices down and, and uh, make, him, make himself look good in the midterms. They told him, no, <laughs> no. And on top of that, it's not Russia, it's Saudi Arabia, who in OPEC Plus insisted on a 2 million barrel per day cut in oil production. I mean, you, you can't make this stuff up. So slap in the face after slap in the face from the Saudis to the Americans. And now, you know, instead of normalizing ties with Israel, which was what was expected of the Saudis after Bahrain and UAE, instead of doing what the Americans want, the Saudis do a 180 and go normalize with Iran, Yemen, Syria. I can guarantee you, they are not feeling very good right now in Washington, D.C. 